Hi sweeties, I've made this cake because on Sunday it's gonna be Father's Day. The base of the cake is a coffee cake and uh, the frosting as well is uh, with coffee flavors on it. So I hope you like it and that you enjoy my tutorial. In a bowl I'm adding some butter, sugar and uh, some coffee. And then make a mix all together until it is all nice and fluffy. I'm adding four eggs, one at a time. some flour, baking powder and chocolate powder as well. To make the cake I'm going to use this silicone mold which I really really like. First of all because it's going to be easier to make it, we don't have to shape it, the cake into a jersey but we already have it done so we're not gonna have any leftover and what's nice about this mold is that we can change it we can use it as well for a t-shirt with a tie and we can use it for women as well I mean if we make just a few changes it is very versatile I'm pouring the mixture into the mold And I'm gonna bake it in a preheated oven for about 30 minutes at 170 degrees. Once the cake is cold, I'm going to remove just the top cake so it is all nice and flat. To remove the cake from the mold, I'm going to flip it over with the help of a cake board. And I'm going to remove the mold very gentle. To make the coffee frosting, I'm going to mix the sugar and the yolks. Then I'm gonna add some starch and coffee granules. Then I'm pouring some warm milk. Then I'm putting everything on a saucepan at a low heat and keep mixing for a couple of minutes until it is more dense. Now I'm going to leave to cool completely and on the top I'm going to put some clean film so it won't make any granules now I can go back to the cake cut it in half to make the cake moist I'm gonna add some coffee sugar syrup once the syrup has been absorbed I can add the frosting which is the coffee frosting that we just made and it's really delicious I'm cover the cake with the other half of the jersey shirt and I'm gonna cover the whole cake 
with double cream. I'm gonna roll some blue fondant but obviously you can change it with the color that you like. So I'm gonna put it on the cake and I'm gonna start first with all the edges If it is just a bit too short, I'm gonna try to, to stretch a little bit so it is a bit longer. Once it's all nice and covered, I'm gonna remove all the excess sugar. With the help of a ruler and a knife, I'm going to add some lines on the cake and I'm not going to use the knife where it is sharp but on the other side to make all the lines and all the lines are half inches distant one to each other and the same I'm going to do on the sleeves. Then I'm going to draw the sewing lines as well and with some template that I've made myself using some serial card box I'm cutting the letters and the number that I'm going to put on the cake. Here I'm going to write in Italian but you can change it to an English. I hope you like this video, if so please don't forget to thumbs up and if you're new to the channel subscribe to get all my new videos. On my channel you can find tutorials of the most beautiful cartoons about Easter and much much more.